Hello, my name is Monique. My channel is called Dutch Monique because I'm from the Netherlands. Uh, oh, the lightning isn't great, huh? Let's see uh, if I can turn the light on. Oh, it's not great, the light. Well, it's late in the afternoon. Maybe that's better. Is it better? Yeah, I think it's better. Uh, it's late in the afternoon, so it's... Uh, getting dark although it's been a great day here in the Netherlands 16 degrees and the sun is shining but uh, you're not here to talk about the weather to hear me talk about the weather no you are here because it is time for my empties and let's see if we can um, hit the number 36 36 Monique you say why 36 well 36 are the amount of products that has entered into my stash in my collection yes I have filmed that video just a while ago and um, 36 products well uh, I don't think I'm going to make that no 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 but let's see how much uh, has entered into my uh, my stash here yeah, when we have uh, minus uh, the products that are going out because you had a couple of few months uh, because in December there will be a lot coming into my stash because yes I have three advent calendars or four I think I had four I have four I have four it is insane it is insane okay let's see well what is an empty video well I show you all the products that I have used that has gone empty for in this month uh, several products I've used for several weeks uh, so uh, but all they were uh, <coughs> they were all empty in the month of October and uh, yes I collect them and I will give you a little review about them if I liked it or didn't like it or the yeah that kind of things okay the first product that is empty is this from L'Oreal and this was a hand sanitizer well we know several years ago COVID in every box there was a hand sanitizer and I have received this in the Look Fantastic box um, this was in my handbag and uh, well it's it's gone now it's empty finally uh, another product um, oh yeah did I like it mm, no I didn't like this one very much because it after I used it my hands were feeling uh, sticky so I didn't like it very much there are better hand uh, sanitizers um, this was a body gel this was in the Blissom box from July and August in July August we uh, in July we received one big uh, a double Blissom box because in August uh, we don't get sent one and this was in the in the July August uh, uh, box uh, the smell uh, yes it, it has a particular smell it was nice um, but I can't tell you what it's like uh, like Uzo it smells like Uzo Venkel, Venkel, yes. I don't know the English name of Venkel. Do I have my phone here? Yes. Let's see. Let's see that I think it's Venkel. Venkel is a Dutch word. Uh, let's see what the English word is. If you hear children outside, uh, my window, I'm sitting in my uh, bedroom and the window is always open and uh, the neighbor kids are playing outside. Fennel, 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 yeah, fennel, so fennel, so that's, uh, it smells like fennel, it smells nice, really fresh, really fresh, and it was a gel texture, and it made my skin feel soft and nourished, and I really, really liked this, so uh, this is from Cavalet, I think you pronounce it that way. 
don't know. It's French, it was nice. A deodorant that is uh, empty from Therme. I always use this brand, the sensitive one, because uh, with spray, uh, if I use a spray, I get irritation. And this is uh, not a, a spray, yeah, it is a spray, but uh, not, not a, well, not. If uh, do I have one? Yeah, not that kind of spray. You know, you know what I mean. <laughs> do I make any sense? So uh, I like this. I love this, and it keeps me fresh. And uh, yeah, from Therma, been using that for years. Love it. Original product, of course. Of course, I have always a ritual product in my empties, and this time it is the Ritual of Karma, and it's the overnight body mask. Really nice, fresh texture. Mm. I don't think they are happy. No, uh, but a uh, really nice, fresh, fresh texture. Uh, it's a jelly uh, texture. Really great. A hairspray from Proset is my favorite hairspray. This is my hairspray to go. Not expensive, but it keeps my hair the way I like it. I have used a glow mask. I received this in a gift that was sent to me from Tove. Tove is my friend. She lives in Norway, and she sent me uh, a box with goodies for my birthday in August and this was one of the products and I loved it. It made my skin feel so soft and great and amazing. Um, yeah, a perfume. I finished a perfume from the uh, Perfumes de Marly. The Lina Exclusive. Very nice one. I love this one and it is on my wish list. This one. Yeah. It's a very famous, everybody is raving about this uh, smell and I like it, I like it so much. From Estee Lauder, uh, the Advanced Night Repair. I've been using, yeah, this is not a new product for me. Several years ago I uh, also had it every now and then I, I, have, I, I buy this. Um, How did I receive this? I really don't know. I really don't know. Uh, but uh, I like it, and it, uh, yeah, it works very well for my skin. So great product. A mascara. Every three months I uh, change my mascaras because yes, I am very. Uh, uh, Oh, I can't get the words today. Well, uh, I'm very careful with my eyes. So every three months I rotate. Uh, I th oh, throw away the old mascara and I uh, grab new ones. So in October I grabbed a new one. And this is the old one. And there, if I'm right, there is a second one also in it. This one was here upstairs in my stash. When I do my makeup, I sit over there. And this one was there. And I have another one that is was in my makeup bag. And my makeup bag from work. And my makeup bag for work is downstairs. Uh, because when I have to go to work, I have a separate uh, bag with my, let's say, everyday makeup or easy makeup. Uh, because I get up at 5.30 in the morning, then I do my breakfast, and while I'm doing my breakfast downstairs, I'm doing also I'm also doing my makeup. So that is downstairs, I have also a little bag with makeup, my work makeup bag, I call that. So this was in my work makeup bag. Then another, uh, yes, this also empty. This was, uh, don't see the bottle anywhere, this was a sample from Guerlain Rose Amira. It was a sample, but I think I throw away the bottle and I put the card in here. Um, the Bambo Cream. This was in my uh, Advent Calendar Project Pen. So it's empty. Took this with me on my vacation to Turkey. It smells lovely. It smells 
it's so lovely, it smells so good. <coughs> a body wash from Sol de Janeiro, the pinky one. This smells also lovely. Lovely, yes. Also very lovely and I, yes, I will buy that again. It's so, yes, it smells are so good from Sol de Janeiro. I like the blue one, I like the, the original, the bamboo cream, and I like the pink one. They have one or two more. They have an orange one. I haven't tried that one yet, but... <coughs> and yes, I have, I'm so sorry if I'm coughing, but I have a little cold. It's not very bad, but uh, I was in 30 degrees uh, last week and now I'm in... 15, 16 degrees, so uh, yeah, uh, my body is reacting to that. Um, a sunscreen, took this with me on vacation, uh, used it all the way, so uh, this is uh, from 71 Coco Sun, smelled nice, uh, had an SPF of 50 plus for UVA and UVB, and it's uh, water resistant. And it's, uh, it respects the ocean and it's good for the skin. So, nice to have that. <coughs> I also took this face cream with me on vacation. Um, it, isn't not, it isn't empty, but I didn't like this one at all. Uh, it didn't smell nice. Um, it made me, I think the right word is nauseous. When you are getting sick and you almost throw up is it nauseous let me know uh, because if that was the case with this cream it really makes me want to puke so no not for me uh, from Weleda a body butter that's empty that was also in my advent calendar project pen I have here a serum and tanning serum uh, I am decluttering this because it is something that I don't use I, I just don't use it um, I've used it once or twice and I just forget it and yeah it's lying there in my bathroom and it's uh, yeah I just don't use it so I'm throwing this away Uh, the Ritual, another Ritual product, the Ritual of Karma. This was a foot cream for my feet and it smells nice and it nourished my feet very much and a lovely product. We'll buy this again, yes of course. And I have here a Lift Me Up sheet mask from Acacia, another sheet mask. This was also in my birthday gift from Tove. So I used it. Oh, I have two products. I forget two products. Do I forget them? No. Oh, no, 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 no. No, they are, they are in here. Yes, I see them now. I thought I forgot it, but no, it's here. Uh, from Aleda, the Firming Day Cream. Um, didn't like the smell. I've used it, didn't like the smell, so... Uh, that was also in my Advent Calendar Project pen. We have here from the Ordinary a Multipeptide Lush and Brow Serum. I've been using this for a while, I think, from February, the beginning of the year. I bought this and I started using it. And um, did I see any difference? No. But uh, I have from myself long lashes so uh, yeah it did, did, didn't do anything for me not that I could see uh, instant firm eye tightener from Peter Thomas Roth uh, I gave this to my husband to try because uh, well my husband is 14 years older than I am and he has a lot of uh, texture there and uh, a funny story, uh, uh, my uh, husband, uh, several years ago, our granddaughter was three years old, she's now 17, uh, she was three years old and 
we couldn't go to them because my husband had a really bad back and he could hardly walk and well it was really uh, not a good time at the moment then uh, he was in need of an operation so uh, <coughs> and uh, the granddaughter said to her uh, mother and uh, the, the, the oldest daughter the first daughter of my husband he has a daughter from another marriage and uh, our granddaughter said to her "Von, uh, well uh, why can't uh, uh, granddaddy come and uh, my husband's daughter said well uh, granddaddy has a uh, uh, very yes he, he's hurt his back and he needs operation and he can't drive the whole way to, to here they live uh, near Utrecht in the middle of the Netherlands and we are living at the, at the coast side it's a one hour drive it's not far but it was at that moment it was too far for my husband to drive so uh, and uh, she explained it to her daughter why we couldn't come to visit and she, the, our granddaughter was thinking and she said yes I understand because granddaddy is very very old he was at that time he was uh, 58 <laughs> he is very very old because mom He's broken here. <laughs> so that was a really funny story. Well, my husband is still broken here. Huh? He has those uh, kraaienpoten. It's the Dutch word. Uh, so I thought, well, I give him this to uh, see if it works. Well, he applied it once and he says, ah, it's sticky. My husband doesn't like any body lotions or he finds all creams sticky. I say you're crazy but uh, he finds it sticky so he only used it once uh, and I don't think I need it so uh, I will declutter this oh, yeah Grandbody, granddaddy is broken yeah uh, this one yes the gosh soft tint lip balm I really love this one and it's not that old I have received this in goodie box I think but it's it smells awful it I don't know it smells I wanted to apply it on my lips I I was using it it was lying downstairs and I thought well oh let's uh, every time I go out out of the house eh, to, to do a grocery or something like that uh, I apply something on my lips and I grabbed this and the week before that it was still fine and I grabbed it and it had such a horrible horrible smell so uh, yes I decluttered it but it is lovely it's really lovely color and but it stinks it stinks very much oh yes this the eye cream I mentioned in my uh, advent calendar project pen that my eye, eye cream was empty well here it is it is from Barbara Stroom uh, received this in I think in the look fantastic advent calendar last year I think or in the Douglas advent calendar I think in the Douglas advent calendar and it's a lovely lovely eye cream it is amazing it I love it it is expensive, but I would buy it in an instant. I would buy it immediately. Yeah. Another product that is in my uh, that was in my advent calendar project pen was this niacinamide serum from Giorgio Bay. Love this. Loved using it. And uh, this was in my gift from Tove from Dr. Anke Stern. And it was the uh, wash the day of wash the day of facial cleanser, really lovely, lovely. Uh, it didn't make my skin dry. It 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 was really it didn't make my skin taggy. It was nice. It was really nice. A second cleanse. I use this as a second cleanse. And then the last product is from Evoluderm, and this is the 
a smoothing food scrub and I have received this in a goodie box so it's empty it's gone so yeah that were the products let's see 36 what's the number we have to hit one two three four five six seven Twenty-seven. So nine products have entered into my stash. Well, not bad considering um, there were thirty-six products coming in. 36 products coming in and are 27 and, and because of an advent calendar and there are 27 going out not bad not bad at all if you don't count the, the advent calendar with 24 products not bad I think okay well these were my empties. Let me know your thoughts. Do you, have you used anything that I have been using? And what is your opinion about it? Let me know down below. And uh, see you the next time in the next video. Take care. Be kind to each other. Bye.